So the low beam is LED mm -hmm. with a projector mm -hmm. to get the homogen light in front of the car. And in cities we also add... That's the shrine projector that, that, that is blinking two times, is that right? Yes, exactly. Yeah. That's a low beam. And in, in the town we also add the cornering lights to get a very wide light distribution. Yeah, for children or other uh, people. Just uh, when you're cornering or every time the town you need this white beam. Yeah. Yes, there's a cornering is on, uh, on the right and on uh, the left. Just when you corner. Yes. No, um, it's not auto beam now, it's not auto. Now it's just low beam. It's low beam because the, the the camera is recognizing the, uh. the lamps here in the city. 50 okay. 50 kilometers 50 kilometers and without street lights then oh, okay. it will switch on and it switches on in a way um, not full on you will see it soon um, all 16 segments are opening like a curtain yeah? so if we go out now you see zack yeah like a high, almost high beam, yeah? yeah this, or fully high. This full high beam, that's what we see in the first part of the of the road if we drive. Um, your advantage on that in the day was that there is not so much traffic. Unfortunately, also in the night, because now we would need traffic and therefore we have the second car. He will overtake us later. But now I want to show the full high beam. It's about 300 meter visibility and you see it's still minimum the same power than HID. Yeah? But the color is, is quite better. Yeah? It's a, a pure daylight color. You see the green grass and the original colors uh, in front of you. There was a special test for headlight for yeah. LED. It is a different car, but uh, there are some problems with Lexus. NX because when it's auto beam, yeah, high beam, but when it's changed from high to low beam by the sign, you know, this because this light goes to the sign and back. Ah, so yeah, 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 yeah. This was a this was a big part of our development mm -hmm. because in the beginning, it's bright lights, all reflections come mm -hmm. back, and the mm -hmm. and they thought it was a car, but it uh, was no car. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, but this is done. So we have a, a, the software update in the camera is recognizing moving this. objects uh, faster than uh, approaching you faster than uh, uh, constant. Yeah. Know, static yeah. Objects. So now you see again how it static how it switches on, and also if we if we slow down, it also switches out in the same way. Yeah. So that you have some, yeah. It's slow down. It's, it's maybe it depends about how 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 quick you drive. Maybe 50, it's 60. 50. 50. At 50, it switches on, mm -hmm. and if you slow down, you need 48, 47. Mm -hmm. So we decided to uh, make this as the speed. So now less traffic here. So we ask our colleague overtake. to overtake. And then the camera is working with the rear lights of this car, switching off and coming back on the left now. So we have high beam on the right and high beam on the left of the car. And the car in front of us, if the people look on the right and on the left. So now he switched off yeah, mm -hmm. and now he can drive basically with enough light because we are... And the camera is is now not seeing the real lights yeah so that, that's a test they want to do yeah. if there is glaring in the back but there is no yeah, you see the the gap is bright enough um, that there is no light from us in the in the rear mirrors okay it's just this direction maybe it's going to opposite direction yes okay. so if, if i I can play now, yeah, you see, it's always working. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
that he is not cleared. Yeah? For example, this was one question is always what happens with pedestrians? The camera will not see them, so they are cleared, but you see them earlier. So you have um, with, with, the, with the switch here you can make it off. That that's must be. Yeah? It's still uh, an assistant system. Yeah? But as you see, it, it works uh, quite well. Also on the on the motorways, we have a new motorway light. When the car is recognizing motorway, then the left three segments are going off. So you will never have light on the opposite lane. Yeah, because sometimes in the middle of the motorway there is a um, is a stiff um, border. Where the camera is not looking to the uh, to the headlamps of the opposite traffic, and this we avoid switching them <coughs> off. Yeah. Okay, and if you try with this system, okay, during uh, twilight time or even night time, <coughs> are there some uncomfortable for you? Conditions when you say, "Okay, I'd better use manual uh, changing of the uh, high." So up to now, no. So it's uh, you have the the light sensor. It works if it's dark outside, as today. Yeah, it's automatic uh, light on. And so far, we did not recognize. Also, snow and rain, heavy rain. You will switch on the. The wipers and the high beam is going off. Mm -hmm. It makes it automatically, so there is no need that you uh, okay, go into the system. Now yeah. we change. Yeah, you change. Okay.